football season's upon us. A lot of our clients love to watch their football on a Friday night or the weekend on the big screen. We're doing an installation at our customer's place about a new screen and projector system. I'm going to hand ball over to Joe. He's going to tell us about the installation. Thanks, Shane. Okay, today we're going to be installing a home theatre projector. We've got a nice big room to work with. Number one point we need to think about when doing these is the type of projector you're going to be using. SD, HD, 3D, there's a whole heap of different types of projectors you can use. Number two is your room. So you need to think about how bright your room is, how, how large your room is. That's going to determine how big a screen you can run and what type of projector you also need to run. Number three, of course, is your screen. You need to really think about your screen. There's so many different types, fixed screens, motorized screen, pull down screens, but try not to project onto a wall. You don't get the same contrast and it just won't perform the same. And number four, your AV gear. This is one of the most important parts when you're putting together a home theater. Projectors don't come with speakers. Projectors don't come with tuners. So you need to put something into it. You need to add a speaker package, an amplifier, and also a tuner in order to watch something out of these projectors. Today, we've picked a 120 inch fixed frame screen with a velour finish on the edge. The reason we've picked this size screen, we generally use the rule of thumb of about four times from the height of the screen determines your seating position. So this one's about 1.5 metres high, so we're about six metres back for our seating position. Other big thing is the fabric. The fabric needs to be right reflective properties, otherwise it just doesn't perform as good. This here will give you really good contrast ratio. And there's a couple of different ones that your installer should be able to let you know about. One more key point with your screen is your speaker placement. Now you can have wall mounted speakers or some of these screens are even perforated so you can recess the speakers in behind the screen and your sound comes out and it makes it nice and hidden. Do we also mention how good this velour feels? You'll see here Joe's measuring up for our mounting points of the screen and he's got the laser level there to make it nice and level for us. So we've got our 3D Blu-ray player, which is gonna create our movies and our images. We've got our Foxtel box, and of course our Yamaha amplifier for our sound system. The key here with your amplifier is picking one, obviously it's gonna drive your speakers, it's also nice and easy to use and you can change your inputs just from HDMI 1 to HDMI 2. It makes it nice and simple to operate. Our installation is now all complete. We've wall mounted our screen, mounted our speakers with hidden cabling. If you need any packs designed, we've got various different packs that we can build for you to suit any sort of budget level. So give us a call on 131 546. Time now to sit down and enjoy a bit of football.